Okay guys, a little um, detour. If we go back to the original route map, um, we were going here, transpose determinants, and then cofactor 3x3s three are so joint and inverses. But there's a little detour that's mentioned here where we would deal with the inverse 2x2 two because two, it's a method in its own right. So let's have a look at the, that there. Here it is here. The detour inverses of 2x2 two two matrices. So basically here's the method. It's best explained by means of an example which I've got here. You swap the leading diagonal around. So can you see the 2 and the minus 7 get swapped? And then you flip the signs of the trailing diagonal. So that was the leading diagonal, which you swap around. Then the trailing diagonal, you flip the signs. So whatever that is, you flip the sign of it. And whatever this sign is, you flip the sign of that. Okay, then, which we've done in this example here. And then you divide through by the, one over the you divide through by the determinant, so it would be one over the determinant of a one two, and the determinant of a two by two is easy to calculate. It's simply the leading diagonal, two times minus seven is minus fourteen. Take away the trailing diagonal, which is twelve. Minus fourteen take twelve is minus twenty six. So one over det a will be one over minus one over twenty six. So it's a minus twenty six there, multiplied by, and then it's this uh, inver uh, matrix that we've said. Uh, describe the process of obtaining here. Okay, then that's the inverse. And here's the check. You can always check. So at the end of a problem, if you get some time, you can check that the inverse times itself is equal to the identity matrix both ways round. And it shows you have made a silly mistake or something. Okay, then uh, that's the last intro. Uh, this little extra intro here for this section then. Great. Cheers.